Business. It's time for Dodger Baseball. Hi, everybody. Matt Vaskersian here with you. I'll be joined in the booth shortly by longtime big leaguers Eric Carros and Steve Lyons. But first, let's take a look at the starting lineup for the visiting Los Angeles Dodgers. As the skipper Don Mattingly will line his guys up this way. Masahiro Tanaka will get the call to face them, and the key for him will almost certainly be getting ahead in the count early. We've seen in the past, when he's forced to work from behind, he can run into some problems. Now a ball sprayed foul into the seats near third. And the pitch. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Now the pitch. And he starts to go after it. Question was, did he hold up in time? Yes, indeed, says the third base umpire. Here comes a 1-2. And a half swing that time, but it's a full swing in the eyes of the umpire, and that'll be the first out of the inning. So Rollins set down to open things up, and with that, let's give you a look at the Yankees' defense. It's brought to us by Majestic. Carl Crawford is in with one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. Yeah, he really pulled off of that one, and that's not the kind of swing we're accustomed to seeing from a guy like him. Uh, especially starting off an at-bat. Think he held up in time, but that becomes moot as it's a cold strike two. Do you even bother with anything else here? No, I sure wouldn't. As a hitter, you're thinking, look for fastball, adjust for an off-speed pitch. And so far in this at-bat, he hasn't made any adjustments. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. And if there's one thing base dealers don't like, it's when you throw at their legs. Now that's their meal ticket you're messing with. And very little resistance there as he's retired on a half-hearted swing, and there are two away. Yasiel Puig will have his first opportunity now as it comes with the bases empty here in the top of the first. Swing and a miss on a pitch in the dirt, and it's strike one. It's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back foot right away. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. And you kind of get the sense that he's not really messing around out there too much. There hasn't been a whole lot of setting guys up here in this inning. He's just trying to get himself back into that dugout as fast as he can. Now a check swing, but that's in there for strike three anyway, and the inning is over. Starting lineup for the Yankees, as presented by Joe Girardi, will look like this.
Here comes Brett Gardner now as he'll lead things off in the home first. Fastball too high to start him out here, 1-0. and uh, He's going to want to keep that pitch down a little more. Day game, ball will be jumping, so you've got to keep that ball in the park today. And he watches one miss outside, 2-0 and now. Too high, and it's 3-0. and I think it's pretty simple. The message here is stop leaning out over the plate. The pitcher's got to be able to work inside, so that's just a reminder there. Taking all the way, it's three and one now. Now the three-one pitch. Swing and a miss as he went after the slider there, and that'll run the count full. A pretty dangerous spot for that one. I don't think it was by design. It's one thing to miss your spots out of the zone, but when you miss in the zone, especially up, you tend to get hurt. And a slider, oh, got a favorable call on that one as that's the first down of the inning. Here's Chase Headley. As he swings and pops this one foul off to the right out of play. Here it comes. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Here's Kershaw's 0-2 offering. And there's a swing and a miss by Headley as he set down on strikes for the second out. Yeah, a good pitch there. Gets him his first strikeout, and already you get the sense that this might turn into one heck of a pitcher's duel. Jacoby Ellsbury will get his first cuts now, and he'll do so with the bases empty and two away here in the first. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0-1. Well, if these guys indeed want to get themselves a win here on the road, they're going to need a big pitching performance, and this has been a very strong first inning to this point. Now the pitch home to Ellsbury. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Yeah, after that last swing, I would have thought they'd go right back in, but that's actually not a bad location because I doubt he was looking for something out there. And they are not going to get him at first. He's aboard easily. So the runner at first here with two gone in the inning. And standing in the dangerous first baseman, Mark Teixeira. And, oh, look inside, but that's ruled a strike. Nothing in one. Now a ball pulled hard, but fouled off to the left. A runner on first with two away. High set by Kershaw. Now the pitch. Now he drops a changeup on him. Strike three called, and a great pitch there to retire the side. Adrian Gonzalez leads things off now in the top half of the second. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And he couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane of the plate, and that will be ruled a strike. Now the pitch. Started to go around there. Looked like he held up in time. No. Strike two, says the third base umpire. Now here it comes. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. And the throw on to first will take care of him. So he's thrown out by the only man standing on the left side of the infield. One away. So the base is empty here with one away. And stepping in is the second baseman, Howie Kendrick. And a check swing looked like he went around. Yes, indeed, says the first base umpire. Strike one. No score here as we play inning number two. Kendrick waiting. Now the pitch. Boy, he comes back with a beautiful pitch there, and he's dominating this at-bat. It's 0-2 now. And that slider's going to make some guys look bad.